We are back with part two of A Perfect Player, Mr. Perfect in the Vanarama National League. You guys hit the like target on part one. We're doing the same again. 20 likes on this video and we'll do part three. So how did he get on? Well, York are champions in the Vanarama National League North, finishing with 101 points. Solihull Moors finishing second with 92 points. But how did Mr. Perfect do? Well, 34 goals. An average rating of 8.86, 24 assists, and 34 player of the matches. Absolutely willing this team forward. Propelling them into first place of the table, getting them promoted, two promotions in a row. There's a reason his name is Mr. Perfect, because he's just the perfect player. And he's played all over the park. Left winger, striker, centre midfield, right back, left back, attacking midfield, and a game a defender, centre back. His lowest average rating for all these positions is an 8.56. Just dominant wherever he plays. His career so far, he's played 81 games for York, 72 goals scored, 51 assists, 71 player of the matches, and averaging a 9.07 rating. Funnily enough, he's also decided to take his talents to Austin FC. I think they came in with a bid that York really couldn't refuse, or they accepted anyway. But if we do 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 if we do another video with mr perfect for season three in league two i will move him back to york so we'll continue with the same team let's just have a look how dominant a player he is so 34 player of the matches we already know about but he's covered the most ground out of all the players in the league he's ran for 459 kilometers next best player 369 so he has done a lot of running, done a lot of running. Highest average rating that we know about. But this, he's won possession 1,309 times. He's winning that ball back. He's miles ahead of the next best person, who's only won it back 811 times. Obviously, we know about his goal scoring prowess, but he's also such a great chance creator. Obviously, there's 24 assists that he has, but he has the most key passes most clear-cut chances created, the most passes, highest pass completion ratio at 80%, he's completed the most crosses, done the most dribbles, and he's been fouled the most. In that attacking area of the pitch, he is involved in absolutely everything. Let's find out how he's done defensively, because we know he's been played in defensive positions quite a lot too. So he ends up being fourth in tackles one, coming in at 193. He has the most interceptions, 269, most blocks, and the most clearances. Way ahead of the next person. 232 clearances, 170 being the next best. You can see that this player is absolutely dominating at this level. He's far too good for this level. If you want to see how he gets on in League 2, remember to hit the like button. If we hit 20 likes, we'll do part 3. If you like Football Manager content, hit that subscribe button if you're not subscribed already. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss another video. I'll catch you in the next one. Cheerio.